Want to make a tremendous intro for your videos using nothing more than your iPhone or iPad? That's what we're doing in seconds, so stick around. Ryan G. Johnson! Hey, it's Brian G. Johnson helping you to stake your claim and amplify your message. Now, in today's video, I want to share with you a simple app that I've used in the past to make great video intros. It's called IntroMate. Let's jump on my iPad and I'll show you how to use it. Alrighty, let's jump in. Super easy to make a cool intro. It'll take you a few minutes. Let's do it. I'm gonna go ahead and access Movie Studio. It's a collection of apps I use for video editing. And I'll select IntroMate. Uh, what's really great about this app is that it's based on templates and literally all you need to do is, is type in a few words and you get the sound effects, you get everything. Uh, let's take a look at a few of them right now. This one's Passion and I'll go ahead and I'll play that now. The Dream. The Wire. The Passion, subtext here. Okay, so that's one. Um, what's another one I like? Da, 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 da. This one's kind of fun. Holiday. Holiday with Allie and Neil. July 2015. Okay, so you get the basic idea. Notice all these uh, templates, so many of them, lots of different styles. Let me show you now how we can go ahead and edit one. We'll go ahead and we'll do reveal. I'll select that now. I'll play it and notice we get a, a cool little thing that flies through. Intro mate, subtext. Great. Now, how do we configure this for our video? It's really pretty simple. Notice we've got available to us Positioning, colors, media one and two. We have colors. We can change this different colors and whatnot, okay. We have text, and notice when I uh, type text, we've got text one, text two, text three, text four, five, and six. I go back to text one, and below that it says intro mate. And notice in the... Uh, the video clip itself, it says intro mate. And I'll type in video intros, explanation point. And now notice we're still on text one and we've typed in our own text, and notice I've got directional arrows below the actual type field. If I click up, it moves up. If I cl click to the right, it moves to the right. I'm gonna center it again, and I'm actually gonna move this up a little bit, and the reason I'm gonna do that is now I'm gonna access the subtext goes here, and to do that I'll scroll through and I see that that's empty, and text three is empty, but if I go to text four, you'll see it says sec subtext goes here. I'll delete that, and I'm gonna type in so easy, dot, dot, dot. I'm gonna select done. Now a couple things, it's kind of small, right? The text is a little small. Well notice on the right, we have a plus and a minus and it says size 19. I'm gonna click uh, 
up a bit and notice on the screen it's actually giving us the size. So I'm going to take this to size 42. That looks good. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag the, the player here and notice it's playing right here. I'm going to play it again and see what we got. Video intros. So easy. And I think what I'd like is one more line of text. So I'm going to tap on line 5 and I'm going to put in something here. I'll just tap some things and notice the X's are showing up right on so easy. Well that's okay because remember we can adjust the positioning with our uh, position arrows. That's pretty awesome. How about text 6? Let's see what goes there. I'll put XX. Looks like about the same position. I'm going to add in a caveman. Okay, now I'm done. However, it's just not balanced right at all. So what I'm going to do is first I'm going to go back to text 1 and I'm going to increase or in, uh, position this a little bit higher like so. I'm also going to increase the text size, the, the, the font size. Now I'm going to go to text 4. If you remember, that's the so easy. And I'm going to move that up a bit. Okay, that looks good. And I'd like to also increase the size. Now notice we also have fonts available. We have color available. We have stroke. And we have shadow. I keep things pretty simple. It looks fine the way it is. I'm going to go to 6. And I need to increase the size for sure. And also, this needs to have an explanation point. That looks good. And I'm just playing around and I'm repositioning things. Great. Now let's go ahead and see what we have. Video intros. So easy a caveman could do it. Awesome. That looks fantastic. So there you have it. Really simple to create fun, engaging intros for your videos in minutes. You know, back in the day, I filmed on my iPhone. In fact, right now what you're watching is being filmed on my iPhone 6S Plus. Uh, I edited on my iPad. I sent the video straight to the iPad. I used iMovie. I used other apps. I used Image software like word swag and avery and i was able to create engaging fun videos incredibly quickly an hour and they were done now i'll link to some of those other videos i mentioned in the youtube cards if you haven't subscribed to brian g johnson tv go ahead and do that now i upload new videos on wednesdays and thursdays and sometimes on friday i'll see you soon here it comes you ready poof pixie dust